What's happening people? Welcome to All Souls and today we're going to review this Apple iPhone X. Make sure you subscribe. Hey guys, it's All Souls. Just before I start this video, as you can see, I'm wrapping the All Souls gear. So make sure you subscribe to this uh, channel as uh, there's a lot more videos yet to come. Uh, regarding the old iPhone X and uh, yeah follow me on any of these social media that I'll be uploading as much as I can on what upcoming videos uh, I'm going to bring uh, on the iPhone X comparison videos real versus fake videos see if you can bypass the face uh, face ID any kinds of videos that uh, I can be doing on the iPhone X I will be doing so make sure you subscribe for that and if you're new to this channel then obviously subscribe and hit that bell notification uh, so you can get uh, all the notifications as soon as I upload. Anyways, here we have the iPhone X. Um, a bit of an upgrade from my iPhone 7 Plus, which I did a uh, last year. I did an unboxing of that, and uh, yeah, it was in jet black, um, 256 GB. But what an upgrade. What I wanted to do is forget about the iPhone 8. I think it's just similar, similar to this iPhone 7, but just a few more... Um, specifications on the iPhone 8 but yeah I wanted to uh, get the iPhone 8 iPhone X sorry and yeah I'm super excited as I've just received it today so instead of doing the old unboxing where I take off the thing let's do a quick montage video of me unboxing my new iPhone X Taking this out of the box and putting it into my hands, it is going to take time to get used to it as you have to swipe up to unlock. Now if you activated Face ID, then it would have to automatically unlock, but as I've not set it all up at the moment, I've just put the PIN code in. Now if you look at the top left hand corner and you swipe down, that goes to your notifications. And on the top right hand corner, you swipe down for your control center. Now uh, to activate the... Uh, menu you don't actually you just swipe up and it goes back to the menu but um, what also uh, it's got a good feature is if you don't want um, app, you can just swipe at the bottom and it'll take you to the next app and add for you that are like deleting the apps you just swipe up and you, hold, you just swipe up and then you can actually delete it there or you can actually click the minus button on the corner and it will actually delete your app from there now one of the essential features that everyone actually uses on this phone is actually the two buttons at the front of the phone. Now you've got your flash and your camera so if you want to hold it uh, and it clicks and your flash comes on and then also um, if you're holding and then your camera will actually come on also there. So that's two good essential uh, features on the iPhone 8. Now putting the iPhone 8 aside, let's just check out what else it comes in the box. You've got your manuals coming into the manuals. You've definitely got your uh, stickers which is essential in your iPhone. Now what I wanted to check mostly is this is your manual uh, iphone x manuals if you don't know how to use the face id you can actually um, check it out there so that's a good uh, set of manuals here in your iphone x and similar to the obviously uh, all the other iphones you've got your power brick here three pin uk power brick you've got your ear pods which i won't be using also your adapter as there's no headphone jack on the iphone x um, same as my iphone 7 plus so you have an adapter at the end there. Also you get, 
it actually takes time coming out of is your USB cable which you connect to your computer or you can use your uh, iPhone um, charger lock from that. One of the features everyone is talking about on the iPhone X is the notch at the top. Now to me it actually doesn't bother me but a lot of people have been talking about it on the internet about when you actually play movies all you can get is this side to side bar there and then when you actually put it up to full screen you get the notch in the middle there but it does bother it, it does bother some people but to me it actually doesn't bother me it still looks good and uh, i think it's one of the good features where you get more screen ratio on your uh, iphone x than you do on the uh, iphone 7 plus so to me it actually it actually looks good and uh, it won't be bothering me so yeah that's another one good feature to me on uh, the iphone uh, x if you like it you like it if you don't well you know no point buying one another feature on this phone is the control center now in ios 11 you can actually choose what goes into your control center now you can actually do screen recording on this iPhone 10 as well. So what we will be doing is we'll be screen recording how to set up Face ID. So that's one of the other features that I wanted to do. So uh, best thing to do is swipe down onto your notifications and you've got your screen recorder there. And there we have the screen recorder three, two, one. So automatically it records and then it goes into your um, photos and videos from there. So what we're going to do is we are going to um, go into settings and set up face ID but just before I do it if you can see uh, in the corner on uh, your normal iPhones you get a, a, a bar at the cross a full bar to say that it's recording but here you just get a light um, in, well you just get your time in red just to show you that uh, the screen is recording so that's one good um, feature on the iPhone now what we need to do is face ID so what I'll do is I'll do it with you here and I'm recording on my iPhone X now um, let's put our face ID and it says here iPhone unlock cell face ID so we'll click face ID now let's get started so I'll be doing the same as there so you can see position your screen there move your head slowly from there first face ID is can complete so we'll press continue now move your head slowly to complete the circle so yeah you have to move your head again to complete the circle there now second face so face id set up that's how easy it is to set up face id so let's actually click get out of here and uh, click uh, face id to check it up there so it's automatically unlocked to be honest i just even looked at it um, picking my phone up and it unlocks there so let me actually get the other camera and show you guys to my uh, vlog camera and I want to show you how easy it is to unlock your iPhone so your iPhone is actually straight when you pick it up and you look at it if you don't if you can see it in the corner the uh, lock is unlocked so you just swipe up and there we have it that's how easy it is to unlock your phone with face ID right let's check out the animojis on this iphone x this is one of the other features great features i want to check on this iphone x so let's actually get into uh, control center and do a screen recording just to show you guys how to uh, use the iphone uh, anim iphone x animoji so you go into messages and um, type in the number whatnot there and then go into here click the uh, app settings there and go to uh, animoji and from there you uh, tap to start so you can choose which animojis you want there and uh, swipe down at the uh, on the left hand side so let's go into the robot and then press record from there Does it do it like that? so it actually you know it uh, recognizes your facial movement and you can't actually do it for long let's try that again so this is is for 10 seconds it actually recognizes your face movement and yeah that's uh, one good uh, feature on the iPhone X is the animojis 
There we have it ladies and gentlemen, that was a quick unboxing and uh, a quick review of my new iPhone X. I hope you enjoyed this video. I will be making an in-depth review after about a week or two on how I got on with this new iPhone X. Uh, there's no home bone so it's going to take time to get used to. But yeah, I'm super excited that I actually received my iPhone uh, X. It is a bit of an upgrade from my iPhone 7 Plus. It's going to take time as you know the size comparison is uh, a bit different. But the screen wise it is bigger on the iphone x so that's one good uh, thumbs up feature on that so yeah like i said i'm going to get used to the iphone x make sure you subscribe as i'm going to be doing different uh, videos with this phone i'll be trying to bypass the face id with the, a few of the features that i've got you know masks and sunglasses and whatnot just to check if the face id actually uh, really works properly other than that we're going to do a comparison with the the real and the fakes that i've, uh, I've got so if you haven't seen my previous videos, I did do a lot of uh, uh, unboxing reviews of the fake Apple iPhone X. So we'll be doing a comparison to see if they got it right from there. And also we'll be doing different videos as well. So follow me on all these social medias. I'll be uploading as much as I can. Thank you for watching guys. Make sure you hit the subscribe button. Yep, yeah, and I'm going to enjoy my iPhone X and I'll see you again for another video can anyways so yeah there we have it uh, what we're gonna be talking about in this video is what's upcoming on uh, the gym vlogs um, what my weight and sizes why I'm doing it and also uh, yeah just take a look back 